Hello everyone, this is Aurelia at Aurelia's Crafting Ideas. I have a new Dollar Tree haul to share with you today and I hope that you will join me. I found some really cute stuff at Dollar Tree this week. Look at this. These are greeneries from the Dollar Tree and they are just called decor. And of course it's from the floral garden department. I picked up four of these. And let me show you. I'm get the other ones out of the way. So this is what it looks like. Look at that. It is quite a long piece of greenery. And it's quite full too. For a Dollar Tree item, you get a lot of greenery on here. It is very, very cute. I like it. I don't know if Dollar Tree's sold this before, but I thought it was new. And, you know, from here to the tip is like 18 inches. And I like it. So I picked out four of these because that's what my store had. I would like to pick up some more. But I would need to go to a different store. Next, I picked these up. Look at these. I... I uh, bought these last year too and I don't remember if I bought the orange one but these are called spike look how cute they are They're very very cute I picked up six of these they're such delicate flowers really really cute and then I also picked some of these up this is the German status and I also picked up six of these and I picked up the yellow ones I love the color it's not really yellow it's somewhere um, I don't know between like almost like a deep uh, yellow color almost towards amber really cute let's see and then I also picked these one up this is the Larkspur and I picked up two of these these are the, the pale yellow ones very cute I love the color on these and I picked up the pink ones too this is also a larkspur and I got two of these um I love the little berry looking things at the tip I don't know I find them really cute <laughs> and then I found some olive berries I don't know if this is new I don't know if they carried it last year because I didn't see it so this year I I snatched these up and then these are olive branches look at that cute and I picked up um, let's see six of these and then these are really uh, quite long pieces too and yeah, let's see Okay, from here to the tip is 12 inches, but the whole thing is like 18 inches long. It's a really good size. Look at that. I like these. So six of these came home with me. And then I found these. These are pastel roses. Look at that. It is quite a long piece. I found it in the yellow and in the pink and then these are 21 inches long from the tip to all the way down to the bottom but look at that oh, so cute right it's such a large rose and then they sprinkled it it's really really cute look at this just adorable I, these are the only two colors that I found in my store so I don't know if it comes in another color but let me show you what I want to do with it very quickly 
I want to take three of these olive branches like this and take two of these uh, the, the brighter pink Luxpur go like that and then take my pink rose how cute right look at that such a pretty combination and I, I'm gonna just put this in a vase just like this so cute and then with the yellow one oh let me let me take this off I want to do the same thing and let me get my lock spur put that one there look at that you see the yellow um larkspur are on the pale side and then my rose is on the darker shade look at that how cute right just gorgeous i love that idea that's why i picked up the olive branches and the larkspur it's so cute i want to find another of the yellow ones and then i want to know what other colors that are available next i picked up some uh, butterfly stickers look at these how cute i picked up two each this is like the orange shade ones very very cute and they are pop-up stickers and you know it's a like a dimensional butterfly how cute and you get eight butterflies in the package and I picked up the multicolor one. Look at that. Just adorable. It has the holographic backing. I think that makes it even more beautiful. Let's see. On this one, you get nine butterflies in this one. And then at the purple one, you also get nine butterflies in the purple shades. So cute. I just love the colors. And then the green. Look at this. And then you get nine accounts in this one. And I did pick up two packages of each butterfly. And I picked up this photo frame. Look at this. So this is a six by four frame. Let me cut that off. Look at that. How cute. I was mainly after the, the black plate themselves, but I can always reuse the frame for another project. And I did pick up three of these. And then I picked up uh, three more of these round mirrors and these are these are seven inches I picked some up from another store last week and now those were four inches I think it was and it was a lot thicker so I was glad to find this one again it's a much larger mirror and I plan to <clears throat> do a DIY project with these for the Halloween season or I was thinking I can because see how it has that in uh, hollow insert you can just stack them like this and well not this way but with the mirror up and use it as um, you know like um, to raise a riser so you can set an item like that and if you need a riser that is it'll work really well even for a candle you can put a candle on here and it'll just be fabulous and then I found these now these are new to my store I have not seen this before these are vase fillers and it's from the floral section i found it in the pearl iridescent color and in the silver so let me open this right quick and you get 0.7 ounce 
if you plan on using just the vase filler by itself you will need to get a lot of this oh you know what it's it's um it's painted silver on the back but it does have a, a clear gem in there look at that can you see how cute they're like little diamonds <laughs> very cute that's the silver one and then here's the here's the pearl ones and then this is a solid pearl color and it does have an iridescent finish on there look at that very cute and I did pick up only one package each like I said, it's such a small quantity, um, I will have to figure something out. If you plan on using it under base filler, you will have to maybe add in some clear rocks to and mix it in, you know, together so your gems can sparkle among the rocks. That would be my, my idea on that one. Other than that, you will need to buy a lot of, a lot of bags. And then here is this alphabet beads I found. You get 325 pieces on this. I have seen this at the Dollar Tree before. I just didn't pick it up. I did not have a need for it because I already had some. But now I'm needing some more uh, alphabet. So I went ahead and picked this up. So I'm quite happy to have found these. I picked up three of these flags. And let's see. These are iron on patches. And the patches itself seems to be. It's two inches this way and three and one fourth length. So yeah. Yeah, I found three of these. There are other patches available. This was just my pick of the day. And then I found these. They're, they're markers. And this is that uh, the outline markers. And it's a liquid outline marker. And it's by Jot. I found it in the gold and in the blue. Cute, right? I had picked up a couple of colors last time. I believe I picked up the the silver and the purple, the pinkish color. This one that they have on the package itself. Let me try these. I want to see what these look like. Let me grab a piece of paper. Okay, I'm back. So. Here's the blue one, and you do have to press down on your marker to get it flowing. So that's the blue one, and let me get this one flowing too. Okay, so let's try the blue one. Oh, how cute. It is silver and it has the blue outline. And then here's the gold. It is gold. How weird, there's an ink on the outside. There's ink stain on the, my marker. And this is the, it must have leaked. How weird. So, um, well, here we go. Let me raise that. Look at that. I like them. It is silver with the gold outline. And then I found my other markers. These are the two I picked up last time. So I thought this was like purple, but once you start writing, it's more pink than it is purple.
and then the silver one. The silver one, it is silver, but you get like a really dark outline. And you have to let this one sit just a little bit for the, the darker color to show up. And then the pink one, of course, is silver and it has the pink outline. Look at that. Isn't that cute? I love them. I'm glad I found two more colors. I am hopeful that more colors will show. But really, really cute. I'm happy with those. The last few items I picked up are these. This is a Sargent Art uh, pouring medium. I have not worked with uh, this pouring medium, well any pouring medium, but you get four ounces uh, in this bottle. It says permanent when dry for use with acrylic paint for best results apply Sargent Art acrylic gloss to finished project. So it does need a sealer. Um, yeah, I want to try this. I want to, I don't know. I've seen some really cute results on YouTube. And this product is made in the U.S. So, so I want to give this a try. <laughs> Let's see how that works out. And then the last two items I picked up are these. These are tool. So um, it's by Crafter Square. And... You know, before these tools, you'll find them on a, a cardboard roll. They took it off the roll, folded it up, and put it in a cute little package. So you still get three yards, and you get uh, the length on the tool is still six inches. So I picked up the purple and the teal one. I'm quite happy with these colors. Such pretty colors. Now they do have other colors available, so but I'll go ahead and um, add a clip for you on those colors. And I'm quite happy with my haul this week. And I hope you guys find what you're looking for at your Dollar Tree this week also. I'm quite looking forward to see what new items we, they will have available in the coming weeks. The other items that I found uh, another color to are these butterflies and I didn't pick up the other color but I'll go ahead and add a clip on that one also and let's see I might get my markers the two markers I'm quite happy with those markers <laughs> see I'm very easy to please <laughs> Thank you for stopping by to watch my Dollar Tree haul today. This is Aurelia at Aurelia's Crafting Ideas and I will see you next time.